While the House of Representatives is investigating the Interim Management Committee of the Niger Delta Development Commission and has yet to arrive at a conclusion, the Senate, through its ad hoc committee, looked into the financial records of the Commission from inception, as well as an alleged misappropriation of 40 billion naira. The investigation stems from a motion by a senator from the region who describes the NDDC as a financial conduit pipe. Senate is worried further that there have been loud acquisition of misuse of funds by previous management of the Commission, which portrayed the Commission as a financial conduit pipe, especially when the aspiration of the founding fathers has been forsaken. After several hearings and submissions from concerned parties like the Central Bank, Auditor General, Ministry of Finance, Governors of the nine NDDC states, as well as past and present management of the NDDC, among others, the Senate Committee came out with a 118-page report containing 17 recommendations. Congratulations. One of the strongest of those is for the reconsideration of putting development commissions in the presidency for direct presidential oversight, and that the president should step down the interim management committee to allow for a properly constituted board. And while many call for the scrapping of the commission for failing to meet up with its mandates to the people of the Niger Delta, the Senate instead believes that submission of a quarterly and annual performance report by the NDDC to both houses of the National Assembly could help with accountability. The committee also called for a refund of 4.92 billion naira payment made to staff and contractors in breach of procurement process, including the 1.5 billion naira COVID-19 relief payment and a fraudulent 1.96 billion naira for Lassa fever kits, which the former acting managing director Joy Nunier had openly alleged and condemned. The most of the contracts in NDDC are given out to members of National Assembly, but no, you don't know about it. It's okay. It's, okay. it's okay. it's okay. In drawing its conclusions, the Senate Committee proposed investigation of alleged blackmail by the NDDC against members of the National Assembly on the subject of procurement process. The subject matter has caused divided opinions on the authenticity of the National Assembly probe, which was made very evident during the hearing with the Minister of Niger Delta Affairs, leading to subsequent release of names of lawmakers alleged to have so far benefited from the NDDC contracts. While the country awaits the recommendations of the House of Representatives, attention is fixated on the forensic audit of the NDDC and what decisions the President will make. Terry Ikumi, Channels Television News.